Are you looking to build up your Canon camera kit with a new lens? Here are six best Canon DSLR lenses to help you make a choice. One, Canon EF-S 17 to 55 mm F 2.8 IS USM. The Canon EF-S 17 to 55 mm F 2.8 IS USM lens is the only APS-C format standard zoom with a fast and constant F 2.8 aperture. It's ideal for retaining fairly fast shutter speeds under dull lighting conditions, as well as for gaining a tight depth of field when you want to blur the background. It's much sturdier and better built than Canon's kit zoom lenses, although it still lacks the weather seals found on most of Canon's top range L-series lenses. The ultrasonic ring type autofocus system is not only easy to use, but is also fast and accurate, and comes with a focus distance scale that's generally lacking on kit zoom lenses. Originally launched back in 2006, the lens has an old generation image stabilizer, but its three-stop benefit is still very much worth having. Image quality is very good, with impressive sharpness and contrast even when shooting wide open, along with fairly minimal distortions and color fringing. It's simply the best standard zoom on the market for Canon APS-C format cameras. 2. Canon EF 50mm f 1.2L USM. Next to the 35mm, the Nifty 50 is likely the most iconic camera lens of all time. It's been used since photography's inception. The 50mm lens has continued to entice and dazzle photographers to this day, but with its popularity comes the tedious task of determining which 50mm to use. Although there are hundreds to choose from, the Canon EF 50mm f 1.2L USM is the sharpest 50mm at faster aperture than f 1.4. The colors and contrast are dazzling, and for creamy bokeh lovers, this lens delivers. Built very solid, the lens does have a substantial weight to it, but that is easy to overlook once you take a peek at its image quality. Intended for full frame bodies, the Canon EF 50mm f 1.2L USM has an extremely fast autofocus. This is not very common for wide aperture lenses. The lens also rocks an ultrasonic motor with a silent focus motor. This is great for photographing animals. The lens offers a wide range to play with, allowing you to bump it up to f1.8 if the f1.2 is too shallow for you. The other benefit to this particular 50mm is the lack of chromatic aberration. Chromatic aberration, also known as color fringing or purple fringing, is a common optical problem. It happens when a lens is either unable to bring all wavelengths of color to the same focal plane or when wavelengths of color are focused at different positions in the focal plane. 3. Canon EF 70-200mm f 4L IS USM So-called fast telephoto zooms tend to be fairly big and heavy, but professional photographers also favor the 70-200mm f 2.8 lens weighing in at around 1.5 kilograms. That's a lot of weight to hang off the front of a small APS-C format body like an EOS Rebel SL2 200D or EOS Rebel T7i 800D. An f-stop slower, this lens still offers a constant aperture of f4 throughout the zoom range, along with L-series trapping like pro-grade build quality, weather seals, and optical excellence. But it's a much more manageable package. Indeed, it's only about half the weight of most 70-200mm f2.8 zooms, but sharpness and contrast are superb, boosted by the use of top-notch fluoride and UD elements. And the ring-type ultrasonic autofocus system is super fast. 4. Sigma 24-70mm f2.8 DG OS HSM A the Canon EF 24-70mm f 2.8L 2 USM is the choice of many professional photographers around the world, but it's not particularly good value for money and lacks image stabilization. The Sigma 24-70mm f 2.8 DG OS HSM A isn't as fully weather sealed as the Canon, but it's beautifully built and matches the Canon for all around performance and image quality. Sharpness and contrast are spectacular while bokeh is lusciously smooth. Autofocus is very quick and extremely quiet while the four stop optical stabilizer helps to ensure sharp handheld shots at relatively slow shutter speeds. At around two thirds the price of the Canon lens, it's a much better buy. Five, Tamron 10 to 24 millimeter F 3.5 to 4.5 DI 2 VC HLD. 
A major upgrade over Tamron's original 10 to 24 mm ultra wide zoom for APS-C format cameras. The Tamron 10 to 24 mm f 3.5 to 4.5 Di2 VC HLD has improved optics, a four-stop VC system, and a new HLD autofocus system. Handling is also improved as the focus ring no longer rotates during autofocus and enables full-time manual override. The good quality build includes weather seals and a key clean fluorine coating on the front element. Image quality benefits from good sharpness and contrast, along with well-contained distortions for an ultra-wide zoom lens and fairly minimal color fringing. 6. Canon EF 35mm f1.4 L2 USM Just as much a celebrity in the photography world as the 50mm, the 35mm grew to fame with its multitude of applications and videography use. As such, every camera brand on the planet has a hundred different versions of the same lens. Canon has a rather memorable one. The Canon EF 35mm f1.4 L2 USM is an updated version of its predecessor with notable improvements. This lens is not small or light, but it is an impressive performer. It delivers remarkable image quality at an extreme wide aperture. We guarantee it will make any low light photographer weak in the knees. The lens focus is to 11 inches, impressive for 35 millimeter. This lens is very sharp, especially for being so wide open. There's a big jump in clarity from other models, especially when compared to the Tamron or Sigma equivalent. 